name is Molly Dennis, and I'm here with my coworker Sarah Paplinus, and she's expecting. Today we wanted to show you a few taping techniques to help if you are pregnant. The first one is going to be really helpful to support your abdomen if you feel like you're having some pressure on your bladder or if you feel like your baby's falling forward, kind of putting you into a bad posture. Okay, so to get started, you want to cut your tape. You're going to need two pieces of kinesio tape. To cut the first tape, I'm going to have Sarah find her rib cage, the bottom of her rib cage, right? And then go two fingers down from the rib cage. So I'm going to go here, scoop under the belly, reach to the other side, and that's where you'll cut it, right? And the second one will be about two and a half, two kinesio tape blocks shorter than the first tape. Right. Next, I want to ser clean Sarah's skin. I want to make sure she's not wearing any lotion. Um, we have some alcohol wipes here. We've already cleaned her skin off. Any lotion or any oil on the skin won't let the tape stick as well. Right? Okay. Next, I'm going to have Sarah lean against the wall and scoop her belly up and back, putting the baby back in the bucket in a little bit better position. Good job, Sarah. I'm going to take the longest piece of tape and I'm going to find the middle, break it like so, and try to not let your own skin touch the tape because the oil from your hand will also impair the ability to stick. So I open it up, fold the two pieces of tape here, and I want to expose the middle third of the kinesio tape. You want to pull for about 50 to 75% tension on the kinesio tape. I'm going to start at the bottom good. and go up with that tension. Good. And the outer thirds will have no tension on them. You're going to angle back to anchor on the rib cage. Try to make sure there's no creases or folds. Okay, give it a little rub so that it'll stick better. Great. I'm going to do the same thing with my second piece of tape. So I'm going to find the middle, open up, fold back those edges. Expose the middle third, right, and then pull about 50 to 75 percent tension. I'm going to place it just on top of, so they're still touching, the first piece of tape. Great. Good. So lay that down. Good. And then outer thirds, no tension. It's really important that you don't put any tension on the outer thirds because you want to prevent any skin irritation or rashes from the tape. Okay. Great. Good. So this tape can last up to two to three days. If you notice any itching or irritation, take it off right away. You might have a sensitivity to the kinesio tape. Great. How do you feel, Sarah? Feel good? Yay! Great. All right. Thank you. This taping technique is a temporary solution for minor symptoms and is not a permanent fix. If you notice that your symptoms are not improving or are worsening, visit our website for more information regarding our clinic and the services we provide at www.beyondbasicsphysicaltherapy.com or call either of our locations to set up an evaluation.